Rob Boston. Rob Boston. Rob Boston. Rob Boston's Entertainment Week in Review. Well, big news this week for fans of the Bill and Ted movie franchise. That's right, Keanu Reeves and uh, whoever the hell that blonde guy is next to him announced this week they're working hard on a Bill and Ted 3, which got fans of the movie franchise very excited. And they had this to say about it. Dude. 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 You totally blew it, dude. 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 Well, Justin Bieber got a very stern warning from rapper Big Sean this week. The warning? It was simple. No touching! Now, the reason for the warning was, well, Justin Bieber hugged Ariana Grande on stage while at a concert in California, which seems pretty harmless, but check it out in slow-mo. I don't care who you are, that's kind of creepy. Selena Gomez also angry at Justin Bieber this week. Why? Well, because his new album is apparently inspired by their previous relationship. Good news though for Selena Gomez, those people in the world whose opinions really matter don't listen to Justin Bieber albums. And in the biggest news of the past week, Marilyn Manson got punched in the face. <laughs> Believe it or not, that's what he looked like before the incident. The craziest part of the whole story is where it happened. Lethbridge, Alberta. Which means, every now and then, Albertans still do something to surprise us in a positive way. Yeah. Witnesses of the incident say that Marilyn Manson did nothing to provoke the punch. However, I disagree. Perhaps the man who punched him saw the show. Rob Boston. Rob Boston. Rob Boston. Rob Boston's Entertainment Week in Review.